Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, Luma Moon Tarot. So everybody, I wanted to check into the situation, right? What's going on with the situation with the uh, soulmates and separation, right? Uh, this reading is for the collective, so it may or may not resonate with you. Just take what does resonate, toss out the rest, you know. Don't try to force any reading into your world, right? And thank you, Collective, so much. I love you guys. Thank you so much for your likes, subscribes, comments, shares, donations, everything that you guys do that helps this channel keep growing. Thank you. All right, so Divine, what do we have going on today? The situation with the soulmates in separation. All right, well, your person's getting triggered. Um, I feel like... I feel like you're trying to put this in the past here. That's what's triggering your person. It's your energy pulling away. Um, divine feminines, yeah, you're like, this is ancient history. The past happened. I'm moving forward. Um, that's triggering your person to come in, and they want to try to make a compromise. They want to compromise. Watching you on social media. Divine Masculine, yeah, they're feeling pretty lost. They're feeling completely cut off from you. Completely cut off from you here. This is triggering this Masculine man. I feel like they're watching you on social media under a fake account, you know. I feel like, honestly, what I feel like is... They want access to you directly, direct access to you, not social media, not fake profiles. I feel like this masculine is triggered to just want to be in your presence, okay? Because they feel like they feel that cut off. They do. They're, they feel you cutting your energy off, pulling back. This is the past happened kind of thing. And just dropping it and moving forward. Uh, they don't like that feeling because, yeah, they're obsessed with you here. They're in love with you, Divine Feminine. This masculine, they are triggered. They're completely obsessed, yeah. All they can think about is the soulmate connection. And coming towards you. And commitment. And a proposal. Some of these masculines are, are thinking about proposing to you. You're like, I need a time out. I feel like uh, with the timing factor here, you know that's all about divine timing. But right now is your time. You're on a pause. You're not even a pause. I feel like you're leaving the building. And you're focused on you. And you're on a glow up here. You're just doing you right now. Okay. And your, your masculine, wow, they are triggered. Yeah, this person, they want to be in your presence. And I feel like it's making this masculine want, like, commitment. They, they This person may even, like I said, they could be planning a proposal. Focused, eyes completely focused on you here. Yeah. You know, I feel like this is a, a runner chaser kind of situation. You're going away and they're following after you. Racing is the word. I feel like they were avoiding it for a while, but now they're they're racing towards you. This could be the karmic too, also watching your person. But I feel like they're they're obsessively watching you. Everybody's kind of obsessively watching you, Divine Feminine, you know? But this masculine, yeah, they're in love. They're, it's almost like they're realizing here. What are these? Yeah, they want to have a meet. Expect somebody to just pop up. They're realizing, oh my gosh, I can't shake the obsession of my divine feminine, okay? Um, I, I'm in love. I'm in love, yeah. And that's what it, they're, I feel like they're kind of amazed here. It's, it's literally, you can almost feel their heart just kind of flutter 
with these two cards and then wanting to like pin this down like for real yeah so expect a pop-up meeting this person wants to talk I'm telling you all they can think about is this soulmate connection we got the karmic wanting uh, revenge here on the bottom of the deck Okay, so I feel like the, the karmic is watching the situation as well. And they're angry because, woo, that went on. That one flew. Yeah, look. Uh, the karmic wants to stop this twin flame soulmate connection. Okay. They want to stop this connection. So they're watching it very closely. You know, the uh, look. You decided enough is enough. That triggered your person to come chasing after you. That's triggering this karmic to want revenge and stop this connection. So it's like a trickle-down effect, okay? Um, everybody's getting triggered, yeah. Because uh, this person has a family with this karmic. They've got a family with them, children maybe. Uh, the karmic could be even keeping the, um, the, this masculine away from their kids as a punishment for this. Because there is some retaliation. Plugged in, tuned in. Yeah, they're watching the situation on the internet as well. So like whatever you're posting, whatever you're putting out there on any social media platforms... The this karmic is watching the situation very very close. Yeah, I feel like they're frustrated. I feel like um, they're looking for any kind of information that's going to help them with their their payback. They're upset. They don't want to. They they if they're not already separated from this masculine they know they're about to be if they're still with this masculine they're trying desperately to keep them under lock and key maybe using the children against them somehow and watching very closely because they know this masculine is in love with you it's like man it's right on the line guys i'm telling you I still feel like you should expect this pop-up visit here from your person because uh, they don't want you leaving their life, okay? That's the, the last thing this person wants right now is for you to leave their life because I am not kidding. They are stone cold obsessed about you um, and in love. But this karmic, man, they're doing anything they can. I mean, if they are still with the karmic, I feel like it's being run like a jail over there, wherever they are. Yeah, look, your person can't get enough. They do not want you out of their life. They don't. They have an unquenchable thirst for you that leaves them constantly wanting more. Um... That's just what it says here. <laughs> yeah. They're lost without you. They're feeling that, that cut off and it's, yeah. Uh, yeah. You're like, you know what, this is too toxic for me. <laughs> this is what you're saying. I, I feel like this is you collective. You're on that spiritual path. I feel like you're elevating here. Um, divine feminines, right? Just leaving the scene. Basically, you've got your back turned. You're heading out. Okay? And you're leveling up at the same time. Just spending time with you here. That's really what you want. You're like, ah, uh, kind of um, getting away from something that you were, you know, has been nothing but toxic for you, really. You, you, I mean, it, it triggered you to go on this spiritual journey and everything. You got a lot out of this, you know, this had to happen. But now it's time to step away and turn your back from the toxicity. Like, you don't want to be a part of this, right? You don't want to be a part of the toxic karmic situation, you know? 
So I feel like you're leaving the scene. Like for real, you you are leaving the building here. <laughs> and your person now, they want to come and give you a pop-up visit. Man, these cards are just... Hold on. I'm telling you, this person wants to talk. They want to get on the same page, collective. Yeah, I feel like there's a masculine. All they can do is think about you, think about coming towards you, think about uh, talking to you, working things out. They're being heavily triggered here. And they've got a karmic that's just... I, I feel like this karmic's trying to hang on for dear life. And all this masculine wants to do is get towards you. That's all that this person wants to do. Anyway, Collective Listen, that's what I've got for this quick little reading, you know. Um, Sunday readings are usually a lot quicker, you know. Um, so anyway, I, I do hope this helps. I hope it resonates with you. If you like this video, please click that like button. Subscribe to my channel. Help me grow, right? Become a new Mooney because it's the coolest. And until next time, Collective, take care of you and peace out.